you're in the time period right now that you're gonna glorify in the future. What's up, what's up? Back with another video. This video is on impermanence. Life is impermanent, life is ever changing, it's always changing, it's always changing. Literally, always changing. I mean, in the next five minutes, the cells in my body are gonna change, my heart rate might alternate, leaves are gonna fall, animals are gonna die, wind is gonna blow, wind is gonna stop. All of this, like there's constant change, constant change, constant change around the world, around the universe. There's always change. And you know, when things change in life, it's because they're supposed to change. Like it's gonna happen. That's like the only constant. That's the only guarantee is change and death. It's those are like the only guarantees. So you, you gotta be like okay with that and roll with the punches when change occurs. Because if everything stayed exactly the same, then there's no growth and everything's just boring. Like could you imagine you stayed the same age, you stayed in the same place, um, you you met you stayed in the same everything like but time goes on you know how boring that would be the fact that we look forward to things is what makes life kind of exciting the fact that some things can be unpredictable makes life kind of exciting so it's really a shame when people glorify like the past or they glorify a certain time period that's great that was that time period now like there's like a new time period you're in fact you're in the time period right now that you're going to glorify in the future think about that you're in the time period right now that you're gonna glorify in the future. Because let's say you glorified the 90s, let's say you're in like your 40s or something, you glorified the 90s. Oh, you know, I miss the 90s, I miss the style, I miss the movies and music. Good, okay, cool, you know, listen to that. But you're missing out on the time right now that you could be evolving a different version of yourself and that, you know, you're missing out on a time period that you could even look back when you're even older and be like, wow, that was even that was a cool time period as well. And permanence is everywhere, and it's it's key that this is really grasped because I think everybody knows this, like like duh, like Jeremy, like bro, like we know. Yeah, but do you really know? Because I see it a lot. People should have been, oh, I should have done this, oh I missed when this happened. Okay, like cool, like you can have nostalgia. I'm not saying you can't have nostalgia. And you know, I'm, I'm not saying you can't enjoy things, but don't have such a clinch on things because things arise and then they go, and then new things come and then new thing and then new things go and then they become old. You know, it replenishes, 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 replenishes. Think about a family unit. You know, generations uh, are born and they they get older and then they bring on the new generation and then the new generation gets older and it repeats, repeats, repeats. And it's funny because. The generations kind of have this this rift or this gap because they can't really understand each other because they're so different they grow up growing up in a different time period and the old old generations want to stick to their values and the new generations want to let the old older ones you know know about the new stuff and it could be difficult for the older generation to accept the new the new stuff for example um there's some other people that can accept you know don't they don't want to have smartphones because it's too complicated they don't really care for technology um you know, there's some other people that don't want to make social media accounts. They're like, oh, what's the point of that? Uh, and what I mean by that is like people that own businesses, let's say good businesses, and if they were on social media, they could have, they could increase their business even more. But they don't want to do it because they don't see the value in it or anything like that. So, especially in the business world, they emphasize always being ready for change because, you know, change will happen. You need to adapt to that. Um, if you're always stagnant and you, you're stuck in the same place, um, you don't really build that muscle and have that ability to pivot when you need to. Change is constant. It's, it's everywhere, everywhere. Every single thing in this planet is affected by change. Uh, so yeah, always internalize that. Always internalize that. Very key takeaway. That's the end of this video, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves. Peace.